And for those of you that think this is poop and it's all gross and moldy, it's not. It's from my black soap. I keep this pretty clean because I feed them. Fed them yesterday. I'll scrub it today. I scrub it. But I put this jar. Now he could come up through the cracks in the jar. I think they live in these bushes, but underneath here, there's in the cracks. They live in there. I don't know what I'm going to do with them yet. There's like four of them. But I know that they... They have babies in um, the fall going into winter, and I either got to put them outside or get a habitat for them by then because I don't want them having babies. These four I've had for a long time, four or five, I don't know, sometimes there's only two. They come and go, but I've never seen one in the house, and that's the deal. The deal is you come in the house, and that's it. I will smoosh you, right? Right, we'll smoosh you like a bug. But this is my old weed jar, and there's like a bunch of little residue in there. And and he's up there, he likes it. He says, oh, what is this? There's a little blue dream in there, a little chump, chump, chump. Chump, chump, chump. Yeah. That's old though, I don't smoke anymore. But yeah, so that's done. And I don't know if you can see under there, their poopies drop, and that's how I know when they're there. See, I just dusted it off. I'm gonna wash it. I wash it every day, don't think it's gross. It's a little gross. That's why I wanna get him a habitat, cause, is he coming out? What you doing in there? Hey, they go through the cracks, see? They go through the cracks, and then they got their whole little network. Now, I wasn't here yesterday, so I didn't wash, so that's about, that's about two days worth of poops under there. Yeah, yeah, I just scrub it up, wash it up. I just tried the fish flakes. I read somebody there that they like the fish flakes. So I put some fish flakes there. All right, first off, it's no good because they just soak right into the to the shelf. But um, yeah, just a little bit of lettuce, a little bit of cucumber. They really like the black olives. Is he gone, gone? He's gone, he went back home. See? Yeah, and he was a little traumatized, though, too. I was starting to clean the shelf, and I spooked him, and he jumped down into the tub. And I don't want to, yeah, I don't want to be a little bit. Man, I got to clean now. That's the thing. That's why I brought out the jar. I got to put them somewhere, because I really want to clean and bleach this shower. It's been a while. It's not too bad, but, yeah. And for those that don't know, it's just, look at that, no grout joints. And what I did was, it's plaster. I used the Durabon plaster and uh, exterior house paint. It's like my shower outside in Ventura when I had a little outside, little shower. Yeah, so that's my babies. They're in there, getting stoned. Weirdos, eating all that pot. Careful, it's gonna kick you in later and you're gonna be, what? <laughs> Just kidding. All right, say bye, guys. Bye, guys. We're in there. And you see my spider? You can't really make him out. But I have a tiniest little spider that lives in there. And, uh, yeah, they get along. I used to have a big spider live on the shelf for, for a long time. He lived on there. Boop, 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 boop. Look at that beard. Gonna shave my face. All right.